sorry, but I woke up three bucks. Something just fell off my chair. That's great. So, um, I'm starting this new thing. I don't know how often these will be uploaded, considering that I don't have my iPad full time right now. So, um, they're going to be called Rachel's Ramblings. Because if there's one good thing I'm, if there's one thing I'm good at, it's rambling and also messing things up. Pretty good at that too. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just going to choose a topic and ramble about that for who knows how long. So, get comfortable, maybe get a blanket, do the things, I'll wait. Alright, that's enough time. So the first thing I'm going to ramble about today, well, the only thing I'm going to ramble about today, is hair dye. Something that you can see I use. <laughs> Alright, so it actually took a long time for me to actually decide to dye my hair a crazy color. Um... I don't know, I guess I'd always kind of wanted to do it, kind of. I was just like, it'd be really cool to have a different color hair. But, um, I've always been kind of scared about what people would think. I've had one or two friends that have constantly discouraged me from doing it. They're like, people think you're emo, people think you're mean, old ladies will stare at you in the grocery store. Old ladies are actually very nice about it. It's the white, it's the really prissy white moms so <laughs> stare at you for it. But, yeah, it took me a couple of months. I'm like, you know what, I'm just gonna do it. So I did, and so I definitely, was, now excuse my voice, it's like I've been sick all day, and that's kind of terrible. <clears throat> my voice is kind of terrible. Thanks, What? <laughs> now, fair warning, if you guys, if somebody watching this is planning to dye their hair a weird color, um, you'll get a lot of comments from strangers, such as, Excuse me, I don't know if you noticed this, but, um, your hair's purple? How did that happen? <laughs> your hair's purple. Did you dye your hair, or were you just born with it? I've literally had somebody ask if I was born with purple hair. I'm like, yes, that's exactly what happened. It's... Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not saying you won't get compliments. People are, are generally really nice about it, like, it's always cool. Like, I was always afraid that I would just be, like, glared at everywhere I go. Just, like, this disgrace to society. Ow. I just hit my foot on my back. Okay, let's see. What else was I going to talk about? Um, you'll, you'll probably get nicknames from me if you decide to die here. Like, I'm called Grape now. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I was going to tell you about this thing that happened um i was just standing in line in the grocery store with my mom and i feel like hands like this in my hair i'm like i turn around and this lady just like <laughs> jumps back i'm just like okay <laughs> oh wait one more thing um when you dye your hair if you don't do it professionally um if you don't get it done professionally like my mom does my hair generally it goes everywhere. Okay, I don't know. If, I don't know if it's still there, but after I dye it, my neck turns like completely purple. Um, I found a way to avoid that. Smearing Vaseline on your neck will get the purple to not stain. Also, like, let me show you my shower. <laughs> so that's always fun. So I guess this concludes the first episode of Rachel Rambles. <laughs> Um, if you like this and you would like to see more of this in the future, more of me rambling about things that happen, like or comment or stalk me and come to my house in the middle of the night and lean in my window and say, I liked your video, Rachel. <laughs> I actually don't. <laughs> Bye.